The A320 has fire detection and extinguishing systems for the engines and APU, smoke detection in the avionics bay, smoke detection and fire extinguishing systems in the cargo compartments and lavatories, portable fire extinguishers for the flight compartment and the cabin. The engines and APU have individual fire detection systems. Each system consists of two identical detection loops, A and B, mounted in parallel, a fire detection unit, FDU. For the APU, there is just one fire extinguisher bottle and only one discharge push button. The guarded fire push button switches provide fire indication and the means to isolate the corresponding system. The test buttons are used to test the respective fire detection and extinguishing system operation. In addition to the indications on the fire panel, you have a fire light for each engine on the engine panel located on the pedestal. These lights help identify which engine is on fire. There is an additional fire light for the APU and a guarded APU shut-off push button located on the external power panel. For the avionics system, only smoke detection is provided. Its detector is located in the air extraction duct. The indications for avionics smoke are located on two panels in the cockpit. The emergency electrical power panel, the ventilation panel. Lavatory smoke detection consists of one smoke detector in each lavatory linked to the smoke detection control unit, SDCU. The SDCU transmits the signals to the FWC for warnings in the cockpit and to the cabin intercommunication data system, CIDS, for warning in the cabin. On the A318, the SDCU is replaced by the smoke detection function SDF, which is integrated in the CIDS. In addition, each lavatory waste bin has an automatic fire extinguishing system. A total of six smoke detectors are installed in the cargo compartments. There are two detectors in the forward compartment four in the aft compartment. Each detector is linked to one of the two detection loops. The SDCU on the A319, A320, A321 or CIDS SDF on the A318 acquires signals sent by the detectors and sends them to the FWC for display in the cockpit. On the overhead panel, there is a cargo smoke test button. The two guarded disc push button switches control one fire bottle. Each push button switch controls one squib or discharge head of the bottle. When pushed, the fire bottle is completely emptied in the respective compartment. The fire extinguishing agent is discharged either via one nozzle into the forward compartment or two nozzles into the aft compartment. Finally, there are portable fire extinguishers in the cockpit and the cabin. Number, type and locations depend on the different customer layouts. Two smoke detectors are installed in a cavity in the ceiling compartment. The quantity of detectors per compartment is 
four detectors in two cavities in the aft bulk cargo compartment, two detectors in one cavity in the forward cargo compartment. A dual loop is installed to prevent incorrect warning. The engine fire extinguishing system is supplied by two fire bottles in each nacelle. The APU fire extinguishing system is supplied by one bottle. The red disc is installed in the bottom skin of the fuselage and indicates if the APU fire extinguishing bottle is serviceable. The cargo compartment fire extinguishing system is supplied by one bottle as in the forward cargo compartment. The three fire detection units, FDUs, are located in zone 127. Engine fire detection comprises one FDU per engine and the APU fire detection comprises one FDU for the APU. The avionics equipment ventilation computer, AEVC, is located in zone 128, on shelf 88 VU in the aft electronics rack 80 VU. The smoke detection control unit, SDCU, is located in zone 122. There is just one SDCU which supervises smoke detectors installed in the cargo compartment and in the lavatory. On the A318, the SDF is performed by two CIDS directors, which are located in zone 127 on the aft electronics rack 80VU. The two CIDS director SDFs supervise smoke detectors installed in the cargo compartment and in the lavatory. In case of APU fire detected on ground, an auto-extinguishing system will shut down automatically the APU. The auto-extinguishing system can be tested through the maintenance test panel located on the overhead panel. The fire detection unit, FDU, processes signals issued from the sensing element responder and continuously transmits messages to the CFDIU. The avionics equipment ventilation computer, AEVC, tests the smoke detector of the avionics compartment upon manual test indication from the CFDIU. The SDCU supervises smoke detectors installed in the cargo compartment and in the lavatory. Information of faulty equipment is signaled to the CFDIU. On the A318, the two CIDS director SDFs supervise smoke detectors installed in the cargo compartment and in the lavatory.